Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome to Ignite. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning, family. Welcome to Ignite. Praise God, praise God, praise God, praise God, praise God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Let me know if you're there. Uh, let me know if you can hear me. Praise God, praise God, praise God, through whom all blessings flow. I give glory to God for his goodness, his mercy and compassion. Father, we bless your name. We give you glory and praise. We honor your name today. We bless you, God of all flesh, Father of all spirit. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you can, I want you to uh, just get in touch with someone, share the link, let somebody know that it's time to pray and seek the face of the Lord this Easter Monday. What a privilege, what an honor to <clears throat> be able to rise up early to celebrate our God and our King. Glory to Jesus. Welcome, 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 welcome everyone joining me on Instagram, everyone joining on YouTube, everyone joining on Zoom or Mixlr. It's good to be back. Uh, I've been away from midnight for a couple of weeks and I'm glad I can be back this morning to lead us in prayers. Glory to God, we celebrate the King of glory. We celebrate the King of glory and we bless his name, we bless his name. Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Easter Monday. And I wanted to just uh, go ahead and begin to bless the name of the Lord and appreciate him and celebrate him for his goodness, for his mercy, for his compassion, for the fail not great is his faithfulness. Glory to God, glory to God. Good morning, good morning. Uh, Stephen, good morning. Bimbola, good morning. Everyone joining me on IG, good morning. <clears throat> good morning. Come on in, come on in, come on in. Wake somebody up. Uh, depending on your time zone, I hope you slept well or you are preparing to go to bed after now. It is the goodness of the Lord. The scripture says, I slept and I woke up. It's because the Lord preserved me. It's because the Lord preserved me. We celebrate the goodness of the Lord. We celebrate his mercy and compassion. We bless his name, we bless his name, we bless his name. Go ahead and bless the name of the Lord, bless the name of the Lord. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all of his benefits. Bless the Lord, O my soul, bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all of his benefits. Somebody go ahead, bless the name of the Lord today, bless the name of the Lord today, celebrate his goodness, celebrate his mercy. Just bless his name, bless his name, bless his name, bless his name. Father, we celebrate your goodness, we celebrate your mercy, we celebrate your compassion, because they fail not, great is your faithfulness. And on this Easter Monday, I want you to go ahead and bless the name of the Lord uh, for resurrection. Bless the name of the Lord for redemption. Just say thank you, thank you, Father, thank you, Father. Father, we're grateful for your goodness, we're grateful for your mercy, we're grateful for your compassion. It's of the Lord's mercy that we are not consumed. The scripture says, for his compassion fail not and great is his faithfulness. Lord, we're grateful, we're grateful, we're grateful. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his oh, oh, holy name. Why don't you bless the Lord now? Bless the Lord, oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his oh, oh holy name, for he has done great things. 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 
we bless his oh, oh, holy name. Somebody bless the Lord, bless the Lord, bless the Lord, bless the Lord, and just celebrate him. It's the beginning of a new quarter, and it's the first day of the month of April. You know, ordinarily, this is the day that when I was growing up, April Fool was the thing. And you, you people say all kinds of unreal things today. But today we're saying real things, the things that the Lord has done. This is not just April Fool, it's April Benefit. Because there are so many benefits that are loaded up for this new month for you. In the name of the Lord Jesus, why don't you bless the Lord for making you see the month of April. Uh, go ahead, bless him, bless him. There are many things to thank God for today. Uh, we thank God for the benefit of Easter. We thank God for seeing a new month. We thank God for coming into Q2 2024. If you are grateful, bless his name. If you are grateful, say thank you, Jesus. If you are grateful, lift your hands and say, Father, I'm grateful. Grateful for your goodness. Grateful for your mercy. Grateful for your compassion. Grateful for preservation. Uh, go ahead and just bless him. Bless him for preservation. Bless him. Bless his name. Bless his name. Bless his name. Thank him for preservation. Thank him uh, uh, for the health of your body. Thank him for bringing you into a new month. Thank you for the benefit of seeing Q2 2024. Some people started this year and right now they are no more. Many people have gone, even this 2024, but we are alive and well. Our journeys have been saved. We have enjoyed good health. We have enjoyed divine provision, even in the midst uh, of scarcity. Go ahead and bless the name of the Lord. I appreciate him. Say thank you, Jesus. This first day of the new quarter, this first day of the new month of April, I dedicate this time to just say thank you, to just say thank you, to just say thank you. Somebody who is grateful, go ahead and say thank you. Say thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. All we have to say is thank you, Lord. Say thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. All we have to say is thank you, Lord. Raise your voice to him and say thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Father, we're grateful. We're grateful for your mercy. We're grateful for your compassion. We're grateful for your goodness. We're grateful uh, for grace. We're grateful for favor. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. All we have to say is thank you, Lord. All we have to say is thank you, Lord. All we have to say is thank you, Lord. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. Somebody go ahead and bless him some more today. Bless him some more today. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. We lift our hands to say thank you. We lift our hands to bless your name. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for everything that you have done. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your compassion. Thank you. Thank you for the forgiveness of sins. Thank you for the gift of righteousness. Thank you for salvation. Thank you for redemption. Thank you for renewal. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. Anyone who is grateful, one more minute. Anyone who is grateful, go ahead and bless him. Say thank you. Thank you. Sing a new song to him today. Sing a new song to him today. Let him know that you are grateful. Let him know that you are grateful. Father, we bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. Your credit is good with us. Great things you have done. Greater things you will do. And we want to just say that we are grateful. 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 For all you have done for us. Hallelujah, we are grateful, O oh Lord, for all, for all you have done for us. Hallelujah, we are grateful, O oh Lord. Father, we're grateful. Father, we're grateful. Father, we're grateful. We are 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 grateful. 
we bless your name. We bless your name. We lift your name high today. And we say we are grateful, grateful. We are thankful. We are grateful. Our hearts are filled with gratitude today for your goodness, for your mercy and your compassion. You are a good God. 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 We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We thank you today for the death and resurrection of Christ. We thank you for reconciliation. We thank you for, for, for the benefit of repentance. We thank you uh, for the benefit of salvation. We thank you because we have access to peace. We thank you because we have access to joy, access to the gift of righteousness. Somebody thank God for the gift of righteousness. Thank him for the gift of righteousness. Thank him for the many spiritual blessings because of his sacrifice. We today uh, can access spiritual blessings because of one man's sacrifice, uh, because of one man's death. The scripture says many became righteous because of one man's sin, many became sinners. That is Adam. But because of one man's righteousness, one man's sacrifice, many became righteous, including you and I, if you are in Christ. And I want you to bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him for his gift of righteousness, bless him uh, for the sacrifice uh, at Easter, bless him for yielding his life on my behalf and on your behalf. Bless him because through that sacrifice, we have hope in Christ, hope in Christ, hope that is unbeatable in Christ. Go ahead and just bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him. Father, we're grateful. We are 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 grateful. We thank you, Lord. 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 Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. In the precious name of Jesus Christ, we have given thanks. Somebody say, believe in amen. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Through whom all blessings flow. We are grateful to our God for every good thing that he has done. We don't deserve it, but through uh, the sacrifice of Christ, we entered into it and we are grateful. Again, I want to say thank you for joining Ignite this morning. This is the devotional prayer hour of the Elevation Church. And today we're seeking the Lord this week for, for, for renewal. We're seeking the Lord this week for, for to be refreshed and to be revived. Yes. You know, it says after the third day, you will revive us. I mean, you will raise us up. And as we celebrate resurrection, we in our innermost being must engage revival. We must engage renewal. We must engage reinvigoration, restoration. That is what this last weekend has been all about. So this new week, as we press into a new quarter, as we press into the new month of April from today, uh, we are seeking God for a revival from, from, from our innermost being. Uh, we're seeking God for a revitalization. We're seeking God uh, for a renewal uh, so that we can gain strength to, to, to face what is ahead because this new quarter is going to be filled with new testimonies. Yes, 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 yes. April is blessed for you in the name of Jesus, uh, but we need to seek God. The Bible says we should break up our fallow ground. Said it is it is the time to seek the Lord until He rains righteousness upon us. Uh, so we're seeking God uh, for for a renewal this season. And uh, I want you to, uh, to 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 join me this morning. I'm going to read from from the book of Isaiah. Uh, uh, I'm going to I'm going to read from Isaiah 32 and verse number 15. Isaiah 32 and verse number 15, that's where I'm reading from. Isaiah 32 and verse number 15. Uh, uh, glory be to Jesus. It, it, let me read it. It says, uh, until the Spirit is poured upon us from on high, and the wilderness becomes a fruitful field. And then if the fruitful field is counted as a forest, yeah, uh, until the wilderness becomes a fruitful field and the fruitful field is counted as a forest uh as we bless the lord today we also want to entreat him 
for a renewal and for a revival. And, and Isaiah 32 and verse 15 says, uh, we, we, we seek the Lord until the Spirit is poured upon us from on high. And when the Spirit is poured upon us, one thing that will happen is that the wilderness, the wilderness, the wilderness will become a fruitful field. And uh, then the fruitful field, if there's a fruitful field already, will, will be counted as a forest. Anyone who has gone through any wilderness experience, this first quarter of 2024, I decree over you, as you pray and seek the, the, the face of the Lord this week, your wilderness will be turned to a fruitful field. In the name of Jesus, things that were not growing before, we start to grow in the name of the Lord Jesus. I prophesy again. I say your wilderness shall be turned to a fruitful field where you have gotten a no. This is the season where you're going to get a yes. When the spirit is poured forth, it, the spirit has a way of just turning things around, turning things around until the wilderness becomes a fruitful field. And anyone who has seen fruitfulness in the first quarter of 2024, I decree over you as you seek the face of the Lord this season, your, your fruitful field shall be turned into a forest. Uh, in the name of the Lord Jesus, you know, a forest is, 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 is a conglomeration of all kinds of trees, all kinds of fruits, all kinds of, yeah. So it's not just a fruitful field. It's a forest where you have seen a result before. You're going to start to see mega results. In the name of the Lord Jesus, when we engage the, 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 the hand of God, uh, by his spirit. The spirit turns a wilderness into a fruitful field and a fruitful field into a forest. And that's why we seek the face of the Lord. You know, the scripture says in Zechariah, it says it is not by power, not by might, but by my spirit. Yeah. And when you understand that, then you know there's limitations to what human effort can bring. Can I say that one more time? This is why we pray and this is why we're seeking the face of the Lord this week as we go into this first, I mean, second quarter of, of 2024. There is limitation, a limitation uh, to what human effort can bring. We are not discountenancing human effort. We're not discounting it, but there's a limitation to what human effort can bring. It's not by power, not by might, but by my spirit. And the scripture says, when the spirit is poured forth from an eye, the wilderness, what has dried up, what is not growing, uh, what has lost capacity for reproduction, the wilderness. In the wilderness, things don't grow. In the wilderness, the, the weather is harsh. He said the wilderness will be turned to a fruitful field at the outpouring of the spirit. That shows uh, the, the super coming on our natural Somebody as you press into the month of April, may the super come on your natural. May you experience supernatural grace. May you experience supernatural favor. May you experience supernatural turnaround in the name of the Lord Jesus. That's what I'm asking right now. Lift your voice and begin to ask, Father, pour out your spirit. Pour out your spirit. Pour out your spirit. Pour out your spirit. Lift your voice right now and begin to pray. Father, pour out your spirit upon my household. Pour out your spirit upon me. La crodo peka teka shetayanda. If you have a language of the spirit, pray in the Holy Ghost. Father, pour out your spirit. Pour out your spirit. I open up my heart today, this first day uh, uh, of the fourth month of 2024, this first day of April. I open up my heart afresh. Father, pour out your, your spirit. Fill me afresh. Fill me afresh. Pour out your spirit. I yield myself just as Jesus surrendered himself, you know, on the cross. I yield myself again, Father. Pour out your spirit upon me. Somebody, you're mentioning the name of your family and you're saying, Father, pour out your spirit upon the Godman Akinabi family. Pour out your spirit upon every member of this family. Pour out your spirit. Pour out your spirit. Somebody declared, Father, pour out your spirit. Pour out your spirit. 
pour out your spirit, pour out your spirit, pour out your spirit. Le brande ne kita kosha, e glenkete kaya. Pour out your spirit until the spirit is poured forth from an eye, and the wilderness become a fruitful field, and the fruitful field become a forest. Somebody cry out this morning, declare, Father, pour out your spirit upon me. Mention the name of your business and say, Father, pour out your spirit in, uh, pour out your spirit on my career path. Pour out your spirit. Pareketo shatik arande negeto ye krandenge lakota kushateya. Aranda Galakataya. Father, we open up for the supply of your spirit as we declare this morning of ourselves. We can do nothing. We can only do all things through your spirit. We recognize the limitations of human effort. The Bible says in James 1 and verse 20, it says, The wrath of man cannot work the righteousness of God. The wrath of man cannot work the righteousness of God or produce the righteousness of God. It means there's a limitation to what human effort can do. There's a limitation to all what all our osu and shangri, what they can bring forth. Uh, and when we cry out to him for the outpouring of the spirit, it starts to have unprecedented effect on the kind of result that will bring forth. Your wilderness will become a fruitful field. Somebody declared this morning, Father, pour out your spirit upon me. Pour out, fill me afresh. Fill me afresh. Fill me afresh. Fill me afresh. La puto prende le cachita yande, la grade que te, ye crende le catuco suso to prade catanda, le grade que te cachita yende. Pour out your spirit, pour out your spirit. Fill me afresh. I don't want to go into April alone. I don't want to go into April empty. I don't want to go into Q2 2024 empty. I want to go in loaded. I want to go in filled. So, Father, pour out your spirit upon me. Pour out your spirit. Fill me afresh from within. Yende, le gradika sata, a glegadega yaba, rocotom brenenke shite yende, la cradiga shite, father pour out your spirit, pour out your spirit, pour out your spirit, pour out your spirit, le crondo prende ne kata, ye crando rodogobota, e candere de gebosh, men brenenge, lick a toko suso to predica shete keta yande, e calo gradiga shata, e craduco toko suso, pour out your spirit, pour out your spirit. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. As somebody shouted, believing, amen. Glory to God. Glory to God. We're still praying. We're still praying. And I just want to quickly point your attention to something as we turn uh, the prayer around a little bit. In Acts of the Apostles, chapter 2, when you read from verse 1, the Bible says, when the day of Pentecost had fully come, they were all with one accord in one place. And suddenly, suddenly, they came a sound from heaven as of a rushing mighty wind, and it filled the whole house where they were sitting. Then uh, there appeared to them divided tongues as of fire and sat on each of them, and they were all filled. They were also filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak with other tongues as the Spirit gave utterance. Now, I wanted to say something here in, in Acts of the Apostles, chapter 2, and uh, verse 1 to 4. What we saw here is that on the day of Pentecost, the Spirit, first of all, filled the place where they were, and then sat upon them as, as tongues of fire, and then verse they were all filled with the Holy Spirit. So that, that's the three dimension of the oppression of the Holy Spirit uh, in the life of a believer. The Holy Spirit wants to, wants to take charge of your space, wants to fill your space. And then the Holy Spirit wants to uh, uh, rest upon you for good works. And then the Holy Spirit wants to fill you for, for, for you to live with the Spirit. You know, the building of the fruit of the Spirit, which we call character majorly joy, peace, and all that is an inner working of the Holy Spirit, then when the Spirit uses us to bless other people, that is the outer working of the Spirit based on the Spirit that is upon us. The Spirit within is to live a good Christian life and to gain the nature of God and the image of God. The Spirit upon is for me to be a blessing. And then there's a Spirit that fills the place where they were 
which is the atmosphere around me. Somebody has to go into the month of April. You need the atmosphere of the Holy Ghost around you. You need the atmosphere of peace around you. This atmosphere of frustration must come to an end. I say it again, this atmosphere of frustration, frustrated effort, uh, atmosphere of complaining and murmuring must come to an end. Somebody, I wanted to lift your voice this morning and say, Holy Spirit, take charge of my space. I yield my space to you. I want to carry an atmosphere, the cloud of glory. Let it be my atmosphere as I go into this new quarter. I, I want to go with a cloud of glory. The Bible talks about the pillar of cloud by day and pillar of fire by night with the children of Israel. I wanted to pray, Holy Spirit, feel the atmosphere, feel my home. Fill my space. I yield my space to you in the name of Jesus. My lepra de kasha, whatever space means to you, whether it's a space in your business, in your office, at home, the space within your marriage. Why don't you invite the Holy Spirit? Fill my space, Holy Spirit. The Bible says in Acts chapter 2 and verse number 1, it said the Holy Spirit came as a mighty rushing wind and filled the whole house where they were sitting. You can carry the atmosphere of the Holy Ghost. Everywhere you go, it goes with you like a pillar of cloud, shielding you, you know, just, just ministering divine presence everywhere you show up. Say it uh, in the name of Jesus. Raise your voice in prayer right now. Say, Holy Spirit, I ask that you fill my space. I yield my space to you. Fill my space. Take charge of the atmosphere around my life. I want to be a moving, a carrier of divine presence. As I go into the month of April, Moses said, if your presence will not go with us, don't carry us there. When God says, take the children of Israel, cross the Red Sea, go into the promised land. Moses said, we want your presence. Will somebody lift your voice this morning? Say, Father, I crave your presence. 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 I receive your presence. As I go, I'm a carrier of your presence. I'm a carrier of grace. I'm a carrier of your presence. May your presence overshadow me in this new month of April. May your presence Mark everything around me in this next quarter. In the name of Jesus, my Lekato Pashuto, I carry the atmosphere of the Holy Ghost everywhere I go. La prante ke lo krondo poko shuto ye de keso, marante ke to pashata. Feel everything, feel everywhere. La koto shoto yenda rande leke teke sisata, rakuto prande de ke teke shata. If there's anything around my atmosphere, uh, that is contrary to the will of God. Holy Spirit, I ask that you consume it in the name of Jesus. Let your fire consume it. You are the consuming fire. Anything that is contrary uh, to the supply of the Spirit of the living God around my atmosphere, let the fire of the Holy Spirit consume it. Marodo Posha Tia, Leketo Kosha, any oppression, any oppression that is contrary uh, to, 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 to divine presence, that is contrary to the will of God within my atmosphere. Fire of the Holy Ghost. Rakuto Prende, Lekashita Yande. The Bible says the Holy Ghost sat upon them like cloven tongues of fire. Let the fire of the Holy Ghost rest upon me. Let it envelop me. Let it cover me. Rakuto prande niko shoto ya denke roko to pakata yeke toko soso e grande leke teka shata reko to pradenke nenge leke toko soso to rakoto pradenke shite yende le grande neke to reko to pradenke shata yande ragata karada gabaya roko to prande nenge teka shite yende leke teke so arada galakata roko to pradenke teka shita aradeke teke te yande le grado ko soso soto e bradenge neke teka soto Ye grando lo crodopo kushatande, rakuto soso soto prede kesheta, la craduko soso to korodo gobosha. As I go into the month of April, I carry fire, I go with fire, I go with divine presence. In the name of Jesus, Maranda Kala Kata, the hand of God is upon my life, manifesting as pillar of cloud by day, pillar of fire by night. In the name of Jesus, I'm divinely shielded. My atmosphere around my life is conducive of a God to move. In the name of Jesus, somebody, you know there's an atmosphere that's not conducive for God to move. I want to pray the atmosphere around me in this new quarter, in this new month of April, is filled with the power of the Holy Spirit. It is conducive for miracles. It's
it is conducive for divine interventions. In the name of Jesus, in this new month, I'm thinking the thoughts of God. I'm thinking the thoughts of God. Divine thoughts have an inroad into my heart because the atmosphere around me is conducive for divine intervention. Somebody declared, I carry the atmosphere of power. I carry the atmosphere of grace. I carry the atmosphere of favor. I carry the atmosphere of wisdom. In the name of Jesus, in this new month of April, the atmosphere around me is conducive for divine intervention. In the name of Jesus, Marada Ketoshenda, Yekrande Leketekeya, I invite the Holy Spirit to invade the atmosphere around my life. Maranto Predekesha, I will not be carried away by ungodly entertainment that invite demons into people's lives. The atmosphere around me is conducive for divine intervention, for divine interruption. In the name of Jesus, the atmosphere around me is conducive for the power of God to move. In the name of Jesus, Marando Prende Nekete Kashada. La grande nekete kashita yende. I carry my own atmosphere. It is the atmosphere of divine presence. In the month of April and in the second quarter of 2024, I am divinely shielded by the power of the Holy Ghost. The Holy Spirit is invited into my atmosphere. In the name of Jesus, the atmosphere around my life is consistently charged by the power of God. Rakuto prende nekashata. When I show up, the power of God shows up. When I show up, Jesus shows up. When I show up, Maranda Kato Prende Nekesheta, demons flee because I carry divine presence. Lakoto Pekate, when I show up, sadness turns to joy. When I show up, confusion gives way to divine direction. Let that be your confession this morning. Declare it when I show up. Confusion gives way to divine direction. I carry the atmosphere of his divine presence as I go into this new month. In the name of Jesus, I carry the atmosphere of his divine presence. La Kondo Predicatea, Le Grande Nekesata. Holy Spirit, we invite you to invade our atmosphere, invade the atmosphere around our life the same way that you invaded the room where the apostles gathered in Acts chapter 2 and verse number 2. We ask that you invade every space around our life. We give you permission for a godly invasion. We give you permission for divine invasion. Invade the space. Invade the space around our life. Invade the atmosphere around our life. Lakoto Pranda Neko Shotoya Dande. Lekotopra di Kasata. Ye gradike sete. La gradu koto predenka teka leka. Ye gradike teke suso. Rekato predenka shuto yende leke te krodoko shuto. Rakuto predike sheta. Angla kata. Ye kredike sese sete karadike shite yende. La gradeka tanda neke to predike shite yende. Agla leke toko suso soto. Marada kataya. Le crodoco soso soto crodo pacata, reke ton pre nenke shite kete kete, ranganto prende neke shuto yende neka sise taka, e gradike shite yende, roco porodo bosha, e pre deke teke sise te, le gradike sise tombra nenke shite yedeka. Father, we thank you, la prondo pa, le coso suso to pre deke shate ye, roco suso to prandenke shite kere deke soto, aradaga suso soto prande, le credeke shoto ya dan credeke shite kere dea, la crodo coso soto. Soto topa enge leke teke suso soto arende neke teke sese teya yes 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 rakata karada gashite yende ne krodo parudo kuche teya thank you Lord paride de kiso suso tope dinke shite marudo koso suso tope dike legra dike suso soto ebre neke neke te roko suso tope neke shite yende neke sita ah thank you Jesus in the precious name of Jesus Christ we have prayed. Somebody say, believe in amen. Or somebody say it again, say, believe in amen. Right now, I just want to take us through some quick prayer points. Don't forget this week we're praying about renewal and revival. And we're praying about the invasion of the power of the Holy Ghost. You, are not, you can't afford to go into this next quarter and this new month empty without divine power, without divine backing. And that's why we're inviting the Holy Ghost to come. Somebody, we're going to pray now in Acts chapter 10 and verse 38. Acts 10 and verse 38. The Bible says, Our God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power, who went about doing good, healing all who were oppressed by the devil, for God was with him. Our God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and power. 
if Jesus needed anointing to function in this world, then you and I need anointing. Can I say that one more time? If Jesus, if he needed anointing to function and fulfill his purpose as the Messiah of the world, then you and I also need the anointing. How God anointed Jesus Christ of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and power who went about doing good, yeah, and healing all that were oppressed by the devil for God was with him. Another dimension of the oppression of the Holy Spirit is the spirit upon, not just charging your atmosphere, but the spirit upon. The spirit upon is what God uses to intervene in other people's affairs. The anointing upon, uh, God anointed Jesus Christ with the Holy Ghost and power. I want you to lift your voice right now. Say, Father, anoint me afresh. Anoint me afresh for Q2. Anoint me afresh for the month of April. With the Holy Ghost and power. I will not be powerless in the month of April. I want you to declare, I will not be powerless in the month of April. In this new month and in this Q2, I'm operating with the power of the Holy Ghost. The anointing of God is upon my life afresh. I'm an agent of good works. A lakata shuto. God uses me as a blessing. Lakato peshata. Everywhere I go, I solve problems. I solve problems. I solve problems. I solve problems. Lakata yanda. I am not the problem. I am the solution. Everywhere I show up, I am not the problem. I'm the solution. The Bible says, Our God anointed Jesus Christ with the Holy Ghost and power. He went about doing good, healing all that were oppressed of the devil. I want you to lift your voice right now. I enjoy the same anointing in the month of April. Fresh anointing, fresh grace, uh, anointing the Holy Ghost and power. Wherever I show up, the power of God shows up. I am not the problem. I am the solution. I provide solution by the power of the Holy Ghost. In this new month, Lakato Sheteyende, I will not be empty. The power of God fills me afresh. Fresh anointing upon my life. Put your hand on your forehead and say, I receive fresh grace, fresh anointing, fresh grace, fresh anointing. So I step into uh, the month of April with fresh anointing, fresh grace, fresh grace. My head will not lack oil. In the name of Jesus, I will not be empty. I step into April and Q2 with the power of the Holy Ghost. Um, our God anointed Jesus Christ of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and power. If Jesus needs anointing, then you also need the anointing. You need the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive it this morning. Declare it this morning. I'm stepping into Q2 with the power of the Holy Ghost. I'm anointed afresh. Fresh anointing. To prevail. To prevail in April. To prevail in Q2 of 2024. In the name of Jesus, you will not be behind in destiny. Fresh grace, fresh anointing. Lakoto Pradeka Shita Yande Neke say, I receive in the name of Jesus. Father, anoint me afresh like you anointed Christ. Marada uh, Gajada with the Holy Ghost and power. Everywhere I go, I'm a carrier of solutions. Maranda Nekesita, wisdom comes to me readily. Solutions come to me readily. Kato Predekesita Yende, I know the way by the power of the Holy Ghost. Marando Kotopa, there's always a way, and I'm able to locate the way by the power of the Holy Ghost in the month of April and in Q2, 2024. I shall not be stranded because the power of the Holy Ghost is at work upon my life. When I show up, when I show up, when I show up, there's a manifestation. When I show up, there's a manifestation of wisdom. There's a manifestation of grace. Divine solutions show up. In the name of Jesus, we position this morning for grace. We position this morning for power. We will not show up empty in Q2 2024. Father, anoint us afresh. Fresh anointing, fresh grace, fresh anointing, fresh grace, fresh anointing, fresh grace, fresh anointing, fresh grace. In the name of Jesus, Lakoto Pradekataya, Rakataya, I receive, I receive, I receive fresh anointing, fresh grace. Marodo Pakato Shuto Yende, Nekato Soso, somebody declare I receive. Fresh anointing, fresh grace. La kataya, la kento prende ne katosho tu ye de katanda ye kranda gala kataya. Rokoto prende kshite, rakuto pranda nan katosho tu ya da ragata karada gadaya. Rokoto prende ne kato ike teke sesete. Fresh anointing, fresh grace, fresh power. La kata karada katosho marada gata. 
power to be a witness of Christ, power to show forth the goodness of God, power to speak up for, on behalf of God, power uh, to, to resolve issues, to solve problems, to heal the sick, like how to show, to set the captives free, power to attract wealth, a lakata, so that every assignment of God in my life prospers. Lakoto prende le kashata, le grande keteya da kataya, rokoto prende le kesheta yande, reketo. Somebody declared the power of God is at work in my life in the month of April and in Q2 2024, I shall not be stranded. There shall be nothing missing, nothing broken in my household because the power of God is at work. Rakuto predekesheta. Le grande not not my personal power, not just my personal wisdom, but the power of God is at work, is at work. Marande neketo shoto yande redegetende langro doko to shatige bredeke lekataya rokoto predenge lekato shoto predenka nanda dande grando korodobosh parada kataya rokoto pasente yende rida kata kaso soto egletetende nembro doko shoto marada gatakaya. We thank you, Father, for the supply of your power. Marande Nekesheta. Somebody declare to me, say, I've been anointed with fresh oil. Say, I've been anointed with fresh oil. Say, this fresh oil uh, is a way maker. In the name of Jesus, everywhere I show up, there's always a way. Say, I've been anointed afresh to walk in wisdom, to walk in grace. Parande Neketekeya. I have a fresh anointing, fresh anointing of the Holy Ghost, Marada Kataya. So in the month of April, I prevail, I prevail, I triumph. In Q2, I record unprecedented favor, unprecedented results in the name of Jesus. In Q2 2024, I am unstoppable, I am unstoppable, unmolestable. In the name of Jesus, I record unusual progress. Lakuto Prende, by the anointing of the Holy Ghost, Marada Kasata, yokes are broken. Rakuto Prende, Bodies are lifted. Rakuto pradenka talakata eglekateka shuto. Unusual result. Unusual result in the month of April. Unusual result in quarter two of 2024. Unusual result. Malaka tekasheta. When men and women hear about me, they are they, they will have to say, God has helped me. God has helped me. I am a man that God has helped. That will be the testimony of other people concerning me. In the name of Jesus, declare it. Say the testimony of other people concerning me shall be that he is a man or a woman that God has helped. In this new month and this new quarter, I enjoy the help of God like never before. Declare, say, I enjoy the help of God like never before. I enjoy the help of God like never before. I enjoy the help of God like never before. Rakuto prede kashite yende na karada gataya. Rakuto prende ne kete le kradu kosheta. Divine help shows up for me consistently because I carry the anointing. I carry grace. So I magnetize favor. I magnetize increase. I magnetize joy. Lakoto prede kate kashita. Arande le keto krondo pente kene. Egle keto. Rakuso suto prende ne kataye. A gloto karada gate. Ye kranda nakato. Ebre dekasise tekashite. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Let me just quickly add something to this prayer point. Uh, in Isaiah 11, when you read uh, from, from verse 1 down to 3, it says, There shall come forth a rod from the stem of Jesse. A branch shall grow out of his roots. It's talking about the anointing upon Christ. That same anointing that we saw in Acts 10, 38. Uh, here, Isaiah was describing it. Uh, was describing it. The root, the stem that will come out of the root of Jesse is Jesus. And then in verse 2, it says, the spirit of the Lord shall rest upon him. Yeah. The spirit of wisdom and understanding. The spirit of counsel and of might. Uh, the spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord. His delight is in the fear of the Lord, and he shall not judge by the, by the sight of his eyes, nor decide by the hearing of his ear. Ah, somebody, you enjoy divine direction in this new month. In the name of Jesus, you will enjoy divine direction. In the name of, I wanted to use this Isaiah uh, eleven verse two and three, and let's let's use it to prophesy over ourselves uh, that as I go into this new month, 
I am revived, I am renewed, I am refreshed. My soul is restored. So I enjoy uh, the spirit of God rest upon me yeah, and manifest as wisdom, as understanding, as counsel, as might. Might speaks to courage. Somebody in this month of April, you are stepping out boldly with courage. Uh, like Ataya. Courage to possess your possession. Courage to walk upon your high places. In the name of Jesus, said the spirit of uh, counsel and of might. You will no longer be lily levered. What made you afraid before will no longer be able to, you know, to break your heart. In the name of the, I want to begin to declare, according to the word of God, the Holy Spirit is manifesting in my life as the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and might, the spirit of knowledge and of the fear of the Lord. In the name of Jesus, Marada Kaja, in the month of April and in Q2 2024, I delight in the fear of the Lord. I shall not judge by my sight, uh, well, the sight of my eyes, or decide by the hearing of my ears. But with righteousness, I shall judge. In the name of Jesus, my God, direct the affairs of my life. The Holy Spirit guides the affairs of my life. So I judge righteously. I take the right steps. I'm at the right place, at the right time, with the right people, doing the right things. In the name of the Lord Jesus, somebody lift your voice and begin to declare that. Begin to declare that. Declare Isaiah 11, verse 2 and 3 upon yourself. The spirit of the Lord shall rest upon me. The spirit of wisdom, the spirit of understanding, the spirit of counsel and of might. This new month, I will enjoy deep counsel from the Holy Ghost. I will enjoy deep counsel from the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, I will enjoy deep counsel from the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus, Malakataya. I will not be vague. I will not be thoughtless. I will not be foolish. I will not be vague. I will not be thoughtless. I will not be foolish. In the name of the Lord Jesus, I will enjoy deep counsel from the Lord. Rakata Yada. The Holy Spirit upon me will manifest as the spirit of counsel and the spirit of might. I receive boldness to step into every space where God is calling me to. In the name of Jesus, I receive boldness to step into every space where God is calling me to. I enjoy Barada Katesha Tande, the spirit of counsel and the spirit of might. In the name of Jesus, the spirit of the knowledge of God, Barada Katata, and of the fear of the Lord. In the name of the Lord Jesus, Lakondo Predikatesha, Ranga Lakatayaba, Rokoto Korodo Goboroda Mosha, Marando Koso Sosoto Predikashite Yende. By wisdom, I make progress in my spiritual life, Rakataya. Anything that's holding me back, trying to hold me back to sin, trying to hold me back. Uh, to the past, I break free from them by the spread of counsel and of might. I'm breaking into new levels spiritually. In the name of Jesus, somebody lift your voice this morning. Marada Kata, pray for a reawakening to a lifestyle of daily surrender, a lifestyle of prayer and intimacy with God, a reawakening. That's what the Holy Ghost wants to do in your inside. You are making progress in your spiritual life. No stagnancy. Nakato prende nekashuto yende la grando do kotopa. There's a reawakening, a revival from your within. Wisdom comes to you readily. You know what to do by the Holy Ghost. Marada Katayada. This new month, you will not wake up depressed. In the name of Jesus, you will wake up with the oil of joy on a daily basis, knowing what to do by time. God sends you helpers uh, that will guide your steps. Uh, Rakata Yanda, people with divine ideas, people that will validate what God is telling you. Rakuto Prende Nekoshata Yaya, as you listen to messages in the month of April, it will not be dry in your heart. Uh, in the name of Jesus, it will produce fruit. Arada Kashata, deep will call unto deep in your heart. In the name of Jesus, my God will steer your heart in the right direction. Rakuto prende kataka deke la prende ne kate yo prende kalo koto shoto rekoto prende ne kosuso shoto. Somebody begin to speak by the spirit of God upon me. I enjoy wisdom, understanding, no stagnancy. In the name of Jesus, Maranda kata deep counsel, might la kusho toya pa. My judgment, my sense of judgment uh, will be 
in alignment with God. In the name of Jesus, Marando predica tu kosuso soto, Marada kasasa takarada, ye krando loko to pashite yende, Rakuto predenka la krodo kosuto, Rakanta karando do kushataya, nekaseta. Somebody, will you yield your heart to God this morning and say, Father, every gift of God, every gift that you have put on my inside that has become dormant, I speak to them. I find them to flame this morning by the power of the Holy Spirit. Every gift that with which I'm supposed to bless humanity, every gift with which I'm supposed to show your power, I find them to flame. I steer them up in the name of Jesus. Gift, natural abilities, gifts of the spirit, whatever it is with which you have endowed me to bless my word. I steer them up this morning. I steer them up this morning. I steer them up this morning. Lakoto Prande Nekasheta. Somebody I speak over your life. May that gift of prophecy come alive. In the name of Jesus, may that gift of counsel come alive. In the name of Jesus, may that gift of divine ideas come alive. In the name of Jesus, Maranda Kata. Somebody begin to speak a steering. The Bible talks about a, a holy hour in the book of Exodus. They have special gifts, special gifts. Special gift, Bezalel, a special gift in craftsmanship. Every gift of God that is dormant inside of you will speak to them today. The gift of prophecy, word of knowledge, word of wisdom, answer, lakato prende nekashita yande, lagata kayadaka. Special gift for crafting, for financial solution, special gift, maradakata, for education, whatever gift that is on your inside that has gone dormant, we speak to them today. We declare in the name of Jesus. Come alive, come alive, come alive, Lakataya. Every special solution that has been locked up in the inside of someone here with decree by the power of the Holy Ghost. There's a divine release. There's a divine release. There's a divine release in the name of Jesus. Marando Prende Keta Kashata. Divine release in the name of Jesus. Marando Pranda Liketo Koshota. Rakato Prende Neketo Kosuso Topra. La Grando do Kotopaya. Rokosuso Soto Prende Nekashataya. E Kade Kashete Yende Nakataya. Ah, can we extend this prayer to our church, our churches? And I want us to pray over the Elevation Church. Pray over your own church if you're just joining us from another church that there shall be a reawakening of the gift of God within the church in the name of Jesus. A reawakening of the gift of God within the church in the name of Jesus. La Kondo Pradikataya, Re Katu Sosuso Topredenke Le Kataya, Eglekataya, Roko Topredenke Sheta. We pray a reawakening of the gift of the Spirit, a reawakening of the gift of God. Rakuto Prende Neko Shotoya Dakarada, that will lead to a refreshing in the midst of God's people, the solutions will come readily in the name of Jesus. Marando predekateya le gradike sosoto rakoto prande ne kataya ro gradike to sosoto prande ka le kataya dande e gradaka la kataya rokoto predenge sheta yande ragoto korodo bosha reketo korodo bosha rakota prande ne ketekeya le graduko to prande ne katesha ti e radigataya rokoto prande ne katanda nende de korodo bosha e glekete kesesete kaya rokoto prende ke la kusho tu ye kende rida gadakaya rokato prende kataya a gladika sete ye krando rodo bosha e prodo koto kaseta ye gladuko shoto regando rodo bosha marondo krondo prende kiso toka Ala karada kasusoto. Ah, kodobosha. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we bless your name. We give you glory and we give you praise. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have given thanks. Somebody say a big amen. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Just uh, before we start to wrap up, and I'm going to take a uh, prayer point and pray over our prayer point. I would just want you, if there's anyone that has a testimony of something that you just want to bless the name of the Lord for, uh, whether something that just happened right now, something that you have been keeping in your heart that you know that you're supposed to bless the Lord for, uh, I just want you to uh, 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 quickly uh, quickly put it on the platform, uh, in the comments. If you're on Zoom, please go to Q&A and write those testimonies there. We love to share these testimonies with other people so we can celebrate what God is doing in your life. Uh, we want to be able to celebrate what God is doing in your life. Father, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you. I have one or two testimonies from Zoom right now, and I'm going to read them. If you have testimonies on YouTube, on uh, 
Instagram, please put them in comments. And uh, if you're writing a testimony, please write testimony and then write it. And if it's a prayer point, please write prayer point and then write whatever you want to write. So let's do the same for YouTube, for Instagram, testimonies, prayer point, begin to put them on, on this on, 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 on your screen so that we can read them, we can pray over them for the prayers. The last five minutes were dedicating to prayers. But let me just take one or two testimonies. Glory to God. Um, okay. Uh, anonymous, uh, it, it says, I'm, okay, it is not really anonymous because it says, I'm Ola Simba from Greater Lekki Church. God healed me of seven years of backache during the night of increase. Uh, the doctor told me I can only manage it. I have been on drugs and sessions of physiotherapy. I have been sleeping on the floor for years because uh, ba uh, bed made it worse. On Friday, I was in pain, uh, pick things from uh, the floor. Uh, picking things from the floor was difficult. During the night of increase, PG said, God is healing back ache in the Greater Lekki Church. I grabbed it with my faith. The, the pain left, and since then, I have not felt any pain. Glory be to God. It will never come back to you again in the name of Jesus. What God has started, it will perfect in your life. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Glory to God. Esther on YouTube says, I want to thank God for healing. During the night of increase, PG mentioned basically all the issues I have been going through. During the weekend, I noticed the backache has stopped. Glory be to Jesus. That's the second testimony of healing from night of increase. We bless the name of the Lord for all the things that God did during the last night of increase on Friday. Uh, we, we celebrate the goodness of God. Uh, uh, somebody, Keho, on YouTube says, I want to bless God. Uh, thank God for an unexpected promotion at work. Glory be to God. Somebody, you receive your own unexpected promotion as well. In the name of the Lord Jesus, God who did it for KO uh, on YouTube, it will also do your own in Jesus' name. Um, uh, let, let me see. Okay, another testimony here from Adebola on YouTube. I bless the Lord for my brand new job. When, it, when I thought my career was over, uh, uh, God showed up for me afresh. I am grateful. That same God that showed up for Adebola will show up for somebody else on this platform today in the name of Jesus. Uh, uh, we thank God for your testimony, Adebola. God will perfect what he has started in the precious name of Jesus. Anonymous on Zoom says, thank you, Holy Spirit, for divine inspiration. The Holy Spirit gave me a divine idea in the middle of the night that will turn my project around for good. Praise God for that divine idea. We receive the spread of divine ideas upon everyone on the platform today. God who did it for this person, he will also do your own in the name of Jesus. Glory be to God, glory be to God, glory be to God. Uh, um, praise God, praise God. I can see a few more testimonies, but because of time, I just want us to pray over uh, uh, all the prayer points that have been uh, put on, 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 on the platforms today. People are giving thanks for visas, different you know, approvals. Uh, somebody says, Elizabeth says, I want to thank God for success of my audition so far. I trust that God who brought me uh, to top 30 will take me to a brilliant finish. And that it will be that for you in the name of Jesus. So many testimonies. I know our team will capture these testimonies, a lot of testimonies from Night of Increase. But I want to spend the next uh, two minutes that we have. Let's just release blessings over every prayer point that has been placed on the altar. We just want to release blessings over all these prayer points. I want to stretch forth your hand towards your screen and begin to pray. Every prayer point that has been placed on, on, on comments today will receive the hand of God upon all these prayer points in the name of the Lord Jesus. And we decree right now, Father, we receive divine intervention. Somebody pray in the Holy Ghost. Every prayer point that has been dropped on this platform today will receive the hand of God, the hand of God, the hand of God's healing, the hand of God's provision, the hand of God's divine intervention will release over every prayer point. 
in the name of Jesus. We receive the hand of God over every prayer point. In the name of the Lord Jesus, Rakuto Predeka Shite Yande Radakataya, every financial need will receive the hand of God for usual testimony for you. In the name of the Lord Jesus, Marande Pradeka Teke Sisete, Labra Duko Suso Soto, Marando Prende Nakataya Da, Rokoto Prande Ne Kishotoya Da Karada, E Korodo Bosha, Rakoto Predende Lakata Soto Prende Ne Kataya, we receive grace, the hand of God upon every prayer request. In the name of Jesus, Marando Prende, pray the Kito Koso Soto. People praying for different things from accommodation to financial need will receive the hand of God over your prayer request. We receive divine help for you in the name of the Lord Jesus. Maranda Kasu Soso to Prende Nekashite, Ye Kraduko Soso to Pradeka. Nothing shall be missing, nothing shall be broken in your life. We receive restoration for anyone who may have lost anything. We receive the hand of divine restoration for you. What Whatever you have lost, whatever is missing is restored in the name of Jesus. For everyone trusting God for peace in their marital union will receive the hand of God upon your home. We decree that God restores and renews you in the name of Jesus. Marando Predeka Tayada will receive new jobs. Maranda Kasha Taya, new jobs, new placements, scholarships. In the name of Jesus, Marando Prende Kato Shotoya, everyone praying, praying. For their businesses will receive the end of God over your business. Divine direction, wisdom manifest this new quarter, this new month. The Lord visit your business, the Lord visit your career, the Lord visit your children, the Lord visit your spouses in the name of Jesus. The Lord visit your parents for everyone praying for their parents, for their family of origin. We pray grace, 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 grace. Over your family in the name of Jesus. Marando prende keta kayande, rakuto prende nanko rodobo shataya, divine intervention in academic pursuit, divine intervention for staff. Top businesses will receive divine intervention, divine intervention. Nothing will die in your hand in the name of the Lord Jesus. Father, we thank you and we bless your holy name. We return all the glory to you in Jesus' precious name. Amen and amen. Praise God, everyone. God bless you. God bless you. Have a great week. Have a great week. And please keep sending in your testimony. Thank you, everyone, on IG. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow on uh, 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 on Ignite. Uh, my wife will be leading prayers tomorrow. Please do well to be a part of Ignite. And when your testimonies come, please don't forget, send it to testimonies at Elevation NG. Dot org. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you, everyone. Have a great week. Have a great week. Ignite will continue tomorrow at 6 a.m. West African time. And I look forward to seeing you there. God bless you. Have a great week. Have a great week, everyone. God bless you. God bless you.